yes so it's decline time so uh, kirtan yes. even uh, observation da deti ni trail da trail uh, first of all and ek posa trail and bhai ji puta okay so even this is uh, first and good experience you know hmm. i didn't expect this to it was it will be like this steep or something like that okay i i, I just thought it will be some normal trail and uh, you know after the half uh, one kilometer it will, it will just end mm-hmm. so that's what uh, what i saw on the oh. maps you know? okay when i came here oh man <laughs> <laughs> you were taken by surprise yes okay but uh, any key key observation of this off road compared to others What I would say is this is definitely not for beginners. Okay. Because of the incline and uh, you see these rocks here. Hmm. Definitely not for beginners. Hmm. You and you need to have good set of tires. That is one thing. Okay. Even if you can observe now, hmm. uh, while we are declining, hmm. the bike is just steering. Correct. So all you have to do is you have to put it in first gear and you have to let off the brakes. Correct. You just uh, maneuver body b- balancing. and this is where a good tire will help correct so my main observation for this uh, trail was a this has a lot of loose soil yeah second thing lot of rocks rocks so this particular Actually, the place where you fell yes 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 but otherwise also throughout the trail see even here, you see here you have rocks like throughout the trail this particular trail right yes it's full rocky trail rocky trail. like of all the trails that we've gone it will be more of a hard uh, mud or you know mix of everything but this majority is of a rocky surface then loose soil and a lot of incline lot of incline yes <laughs> can't imagine uh, with the gopro footage but uh, yes you have to be in real yes to understand the incline so this has um, at least uh, 50% of the uh, ride that we've done is incline Uh, so now uh, again when we are going uh, declining you may not get the proper justification because of the gopro fisheye fisheye effect so now you can see i mean i can see hmm. how steep it is huh. with the height difference between you and me okay yeah maybe you will be in a better place to justify yes, that correct correct huh. so you have to watch kirtan's video as well uh, if you want to know what is the steep that we are coming in so Price, yeah. <laughs> so I will also um, put his uh, YouTube channel in the description, so you can go check out his video as well. Uh, and you know, you'll get a proper understanding of what we are currently riding and facing, because he'll have the similar footage from his uh, perspective. So what you see today and here today is from my perspective. Right, Kirtan? Yes, exactly. Yeah. One thing I want to tell is like uh, riding gears is important. Yes. I've seen this by Phil. Twice. Because of uh, proper riding gears, nothing happened here. Yes. Nothing. Yes. It's a small scratch, but it's uh, it's uh, I don't think it's a major one. Correct. Nothing at all. Nothing happened because of the riding gears. Now you can pro. Yep. Yes. Kick in. Yes. <laughs> okay. Now pro. Yeah. And this is the most trickiest part because of a lot of loose sand. Oh. Your traction is like literally zero here. You see the main road from here. <laughs> this video, I think, uh, <laughs> it includes three languages. I think. Part <laughs> of the video. Exactly. Not only English. Exactly. Moji moji language. Good no. No good no. People will have all. Yeah. All language understandings. All language. Mix, mix. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. Yeah. Oh. So all I'm doing is. Ah, would have been my. Huh. Me and Girish boy connected over intercom. Yes. And you, I'm in the open up and I'm talking to you. It's not like that. Yeah. Girish and I are talking to you. Just that uh, GoPro is not capturing that audio. Yes. So both of us are on uh, C30 Blue Armor Intercom. Uh, you guys can hear. I am using a uh, Blue Armor C30. It's an amazing intercom. I have purchased recently. And uh, you can hear all uh, that uh, K 
Kirtan is talking, so between us, because I have a double mic set up, so that's how you can hear whatever Kirtan is saying and you know our conversation for better understanding of what we are riding now. So, this is a piece of cake for experts. Yeah. Just myself. Oh. We are almost halfway down now. Yeah. One thing I would say is kudos to these uh, locals. Yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> this is their uh, daily route. Every single day. Every single day they go through this route. And they, they go here in splendors, dude. Yeah. Splendors, that uh, CD100, what do you call it? Correct. CD. <laughs> CD100. Hero on the CD100. Hero on the CD100. The off-road is just off. People say like uh, you need to have a good off-road bike. It's nothing like that. Yeah. Just your perspective. If you have a willing power, no? You can do. Come here and cycle. Exactly. And more or a little bit of skill that you will... Yeah, a little bit of skill. That is anywhere required. Look at this steep now. Please. And this is complete loot sand. So going down is a little bit easy. Coming up is very, very difficult because you need a lot of traction. And that's when you will keep losing your uh, back end. So while going down, you just need to pick the right path and the bike will go itself. Yes. And little bit of body balance. Yes. Little bit of dancing. Yes. <laughs> This is quite a steep now.